Welcome to Academic Gain Tutorials. In this video, we will look into the differences between book value and salvage value. The book value, also called the net book value, is defined as the total estimated value that shareholders of a company would receive if the management decides to sell or liquidate it at any given point in time. It aims to calculate the total assets of a company minus the intangible assets and liabilities. On the other hand, the salvage value is an accounting tool that is helpful in providing an estimation of a tangible asset's value at the end of its useful life. It aims to determine what the asset can be salvaged for when it is not possible to use it any further for company operations. The main use of salvage value is to find out the annual amount of depreciation which can be recorded in the accounting books. So, let's look into the basic differences between book value and salvage value in a tabular form. Difference number one, the book value is defined as the total value at which an asset is carried on the company's balance sheet, whereas the salvage value is defined as the total estimated resale value of an asset at the end of its useful life. Number two, in the case of book value, the cash amount received when the asset gets sold in the market is the same as the book value, whereas in the case of salvage value, the cash amount received at the end of the useful life of an asset is the same as the salvage value. Number three, the book value is the resulting value that is arrived at after accounting for the depreciation, whereas the total depreciation is calculated only after deducting the actual salvage value. Number four, the book value is calculated by subtracting the accumulated depreciation from the total cost of an asset, whereas the salvage value is deducted from the total purchase price to help arrive at the depreciable cost. Number five, the book value helps to evaluate whether a company's stock is underpriced or overpriced, whereas the salvage value helps in calculating the annual depreciation and tax deductions. Number six, book value is important for understanding the potential sale price of a company, whereas salvage value is important for tax and accounting purposes. Number seven, Book value is used to evaluate a company's overall financial health, whereas salvage value is used to estimate the value of an asset at the end of its useful life. Number eight, book value is not specifically determined by regulatory agencies, whereas salvage value may be determined by regulatory or taxation agencies. Number nine, book value reflects the current value of an asset on the balance sheet, whereas salvage value influences depreciation expense and tax deductions. And finally, difference number 10, book value is considered at any point in time during the asset's life, whereas salvage value is considered at the end of the asset's useful life. So, these are the differences between book value and salvage value. If this lecture was helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.